I'm here because uh, also because I was invited to come as a YMCA movement in Spain but uh, I think uh, what we wanted to do here as Inca Spain is to uh, share what we do uh, with these uh, groups that are um, they are not integrated into the society that in this case are immigrants that uh, Inca Spain our goal is not immigrant but yes to work with people that is having a hard time and to give them tools to better integrate so I was for me it was very important uh, that Inca Spain can share what we are doing there in this area and to talk with lots of people uh, formally in a formally way and uh, the outcome for me of this first of all i'm very impressed that lots of young people are speaking spanish and they understand spanish that's that's very new for me and uh, i'm very happy to see that because um, uh, most of the time when you are a student at the university they say you have to learn english because that's international language and now i can see here that a lot of people are interested in Spanish and they make an effort to speak to you in Spanish and that that means uh, like the you know the part of the iceberg you can see but you can feel that there is much more down and there is a lot of another outcome that I have and I bring home is uh, uh, the big sensibility that uh, all the people has around all this issue and uh, even though I come uh, from a concrete reality, one country in, the, in Europe, I know that there is, we have a lot of things in common, and that's another important outcome, that even though Carlos, uh, Eloisa, and Miguel uh, approach from different realities, also I could see that we have a common line that it's under the shelter of the YMCA, and that's very good because renew our commitment of what we are doing, so I'm more energized to come back and keep working.